This is going to be a video tutorial on how to crop or cut out images using Inkscape. Inkscape is a uh, free software. I'm going to jump over to Inkscape here. And I have a folder open here with an image in it. I'm just going to drag and drop. I'm going to click OK. The way you crop images on Inkscape, uh, it's a little different as compared to Photoshop or Illustrator. If you try to drag in from the sides on Inkscape, you smash your picture. I'm going to press Ctrl Z to undo that. The, there's different ways you could crop images using Inkscape. The easiest way for me is to go off to the uh, toolbar on the left left hand side here. Uh, I'm going to select this uh, rectangle here. Say I just want the dog in my picture here. I'm going to draw a rectangle around the dog. Like so. And then what you want to do, I have my rectangle selected here. I'm going to hold down shift and select my picture behind the rectangle. So I have both of them selected now. Now I will right click my mouse button and I'll go down to where it says set clip. And I'm going to click on set clip and there we have it. I'm going to go back to my selection tool here. As you can see this uh, rectangle behind the picture, it's just the artboard. I'm going to press Control Z to back up here. And you could use the other shapes too. I'm going to click on the uh, circle here. I'm going to create a circle around my picture. Like so. Now I'll do the same thing. I'll hold down Shift and I'll click on my actual image. So I have both my uh, circle selected and the image and I will right click, go down to set clip, click on set clip. I'm going to go back to my selection tool and now here's my image. I'm going to press control Z to back up again. I'm going to go to the star tool here. You could do it with stars too. create a little star here. I'm going to go to my selection tool to move my star. Now I'm going to hold down shift and select my picture so I have both of them selected. Then I will right click down to clip down to set clip. There we go. And you can even do that. I'm going to press control Z a couple more times to undo that. You can even do that with text. I'm going to select I'm going to click on the text here. I'm going to increase my font size here. Like so. I'm going to move it right over here. Then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to hold down shift and select my picture in the background. I'm going to go to set clip. And there we go. I'm going to back up again. Now to cut out an image, that's a little more tedious for some jobs. Uh, the way that you would do that, I'm going to select the uh, Bezier Curve Straight Line uh, Draw Tool. I'm going to select that. This works similar to the pen in Illustrator. I'm going to click here, then I'm going to go over and click the side here. Then I'm going to go over and click right up here. I'm going to hold down shift to bring my And you just and 
what I'm doing here, I'm clicking and then I'm holding down shift. You could go through and just make little points like this clicking. Or you could uh, click further ahead and you can bend that line to where it matches the uh, your figure. I'm going to bend the line a little by just moving the mouse. I'm going to hold down shift. I'm going to bring my uh, bring it back up a little. I'm going to let go of the mouse, let go of the shift key. And I'll just go all the way around. And this isn't going to be perfect, like I said, so I'm trying to hurry with this. But this is a way that you could cut out an image. I said if you want to make it look good, you just have to take your time with it. But I'm kind of working fast here. And then you'll have to go around to where your original anchor point was. You want to click on that. I'm going to bend my line a little here. Then I'll let go. I'll go back to my selection tool. Now I will hold down shift and select my image behind, behind it. Then I will right click, go down to clip mask, and there we go. Don't look too bad. But that's how you crop an image or cut out an image using uh, Inkscape. And it actually did, I did a fast job on it, but it actually did a fairly decent job cutting it out. That's it. Thanks for watching.